Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you for watching this, whenever you're watching this. And uh, I have a brand new newsletter that uh, I would really appreciate it if you uh, subscribe to. The, the little button for the newsletter will appear somewhere in the window. Today, I want to talk about uh, printing and working with film and uh, the idea, especially the idea of pride. What I've noticed is that the work of photography is a lot about pride and about the relationship that you have with the with what you're making, right? And I'm not anywhere near moving to uh, moving to film. I've just borrowed a film camera for the first time. My friend Nick. Thank you, Nick. Uh, Loan me his uh, Mamiya C20, C220, and I bought some uh, Elford HP5 Plus, and I'm going to try film for the first time in my life. I've never done this. I've never tried. I'm shooting this on the Nix T3, uh, and I freaking love this camera, and I am not moving to uh, film anytime soon. I'm, I'm film curious. Uh, I want to explore film. I uh, want to expand my skill set, and it's not because I want to uh, go back to the romantic days of film and and uh, oh, you get so much, uh, so much of a more special look uh, on film, and you know, like all this mm, BS. I I don't sub really subscribe to it, but. Uh, I am curious about trying something new in, in photography and I want to try something that is going to create a different yeah, relationship between me, my subject and what I'm doing. Um, so it's more, more about this than anything else. Um, also, so that's the reason you know, I'm trying the Mami SC20 and the Ilford uh, HP5. Also my first video, I had the opportunity to, to print with Zeno, which I freaking love. Great company. The files that uh, I submit to uh, to Zeno for printing look freaking awesome every time that, uh, that, that they're printed. So nothing to complain there. But lately I've been working with a local printer and uh, I've discovered that I have made a friend with, uh, uh, with this printer and not only does he just print my photos, but he talks about we talk about photography. Very recently, I had the opportunity to um, to do a print exchange uh, at my uh, local photographers association, uh, Photographers of San Diego County, which is ppsdc.com. Check them out. We are an awesome bunch. We're super friendly, and we we always welcome new people. So there, that's the plug. Uh, the, the link will be uh, down there. Um, but. We did a print exchange and I went through him to print my photo that night uh, for the exchange and I discovered I was really proud of the work that was on paper. I was just really proud and seeing it done by uh, a, a person I knew and I wanted to have a, relationship, uh, a working relationship with really made a difference into what I felt about the print. Um, the stuff with that I bought through Zeno it's fantastic. I have no, nothing to complain about. But the stuff that I did with uh, this local guy just gave the print that I was making an extra special meaning. And I think that's kind of the same thing that why people are switching back to film or that are re-exploring film. Um, it's, I think it is part of the same relationship of craftsmanship and uh, and pride in the work that you that you select for printing i don't think these things n uh, should be undervalued in photography because i think a lot of photography has to do with with that stuff you know uh with the meaning that you put behind what the, 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 the work that you put in like you know, and this is why you know with work with uh, film uh you tend to shoot less and you tend to be more selective i really think it's just about finding pride in your work and finding pride and in, in, in meaning in, in what you shoot and and um, uh, like I said I'm not switching to, to film anytime soon because digital offers that same pride 
we have to be more of a curator in the shots that we make in, in, uh, in digital. Um, so the curating process in digital comes after the work is done very often. And with film, uh, it comes before. So it's a different process. It's just the same way that, that film illuminates from the back, it illuminates the sensor, and print illuminates from the front. It's, it's just a different, you know, it's just a different process. Um, so I just thought it was an interesting thing to talk about. And I had this on my mind all day yesterday and all, and everything, you know, this morning. So I wanted, also wanted to show you one last thing before I, uh, you know, I log off for today. Um, for that print exchange that I did for, with uh, PPSDC, um, I actually printed another photo that I always thought had potential, that I always wanted to see in print, that I had never printed out. And I decided to print it. I wanted to see that photo on paper. So this is the photo. And I honestly, I just couldn't be, I just couldn't be happier. Yeah. It's beautifully printed. It's beautifully matted, and my printer did an awesome job. Um, so he's a local guy, he's a local San Diego guy, and uh, if you're in San Diego, I am also going to put his print, his, his website, uh, at the bottom. And this is me logging off for today. Okay? Alright. See you next time, guys.